Well, everything seems to be working like it should be. Cross my fingers. Hi guys, how you doing on this Tuesday night? We are going back into the DCS. The DCS, of course. And uh, it is Tuesday. We're doing the Dynamic War, but we're going to be doing something a little bit different with the Dynamic War this time. Now, usually what I do is I usually will do like an attack or, you know, we'll jump in the Apache, run our waypoints and things of that nature. But this is a dynamic war. It's not just about shooting down the planes, blowing up the objective and doing things of that nature. Sometimes you need to go out and rescue the guys who've gotten shot down. You know, pilots and players and NPCs turn around and take their planes and they get shot and blown out of the sky and eject. <clears throat> and what you'll find is little ground troops around everywhere who need to be rescued. And the way the dynamic campaign works is you should be able to take a Huey out there or a hind if you're on the red side and pick these players up and get X, get resources. Hmm, excuse me, I got the hiccups. Get resources back for your side that help you in this type of thing. So you must need to get rescued off and shh. Now you're just mean. <laughs> How you doing, Killer Roy? Well, I've got a few guys out there, yeah. But, I mean, that's part of the thing about the game. So we're going to see if we can turn around and do this. You're just evil, Kilroy. You're so mean. <laughs> no, anyway. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it, you do get shot down quite a bit in this campaign. So it's a lot of fun. Um, thankfully, you don't have to continue to do that. Uh, but it does place a marker and creates a guy with a rifle on M4. Uh, that you must pick up or two depending on what you're flying so like an apache or an f-14 it's going to create a couple of guys if you survive the crash which frankly we do quite often uh in this game so pretty awesome so we're going to go ahead and give it a try now i'm going to be honest with you as far as my huey flying skills yeah well, my apache skills have gotten a lot better um obviously i mean we saw what happened yesterday where i was actually or not yesterday, but uh, Sunday, where I was doing pretty well. Um, you know, and then I really was putting, when I was just playing around, we were, I was doing very, very well. My Huey skills, on the other hand, um, I can fly. I don't even know how to fire weapons, arm weapons. Uh, you know, do all the things you need to do. So this is going to be kind of interesting. Tell the gun door gunners how to shoot. So this is very much going to be a noob video. Warning, this is going to be a noob video. I am going to crash, die, burn, and blow up quite a bit. Uh, predictions are that <clears throat> is a 50-50 split right now on whether I'll, I will uh, rescue pilots. Uh, I would say maybe. <laughs> It is a definite maybe. Maybe. Um, but it's just another aspect of the campaign that you can do if you own that module. So it's something else that you can actually participate in on our server. You know, besides the shooting and the blowing things up, and which you can still shoot and blow things up and get in some pretty hot situations trying to rescue these downed pilots. Um, because while you're trying to rescue them, the enemy's trying to capture them. And... It could turn into pretty violent situations. Now you can get door gunners that will, you know, protect your helicopter. You can get mini guns and rockets to put on your helicopter. But again, eh, things may not work out as well as planned, you know, as far as that goes. So yeah, fly with caution. <laughs> uh, so make sure you've got backup, uh, which I don't know if I do. I don't know if anybody's on right now. Well, I guess we'll find out once we get there. Uh, but yeah, it should be a lot of fun. So crossing my fingers that, uh, this ends up pretty well, but also, you know, right off the bat, I got to go through controls and see what I got to set up to. So I'm trying to be quiet too. Doors open, wife's getting ready to sleep. I don't want to wake her up because if I do, I'll get a shoot at the head. Not really, but it could happen. Could happen. Just rescue you, actually. They could hang on. <laughs> you know, uh, what was it? Uh, Lusky actually showed us a video of that of guys hanging off the wing. You know, they were like hanging onto the the like the pilot's pull up bar, and they were on the wing, and they had their feet on the Hellfire launcher, and they were flying, uh, hanging off the Apache that way. It was actually kind of cool. I thought it was pretty pretty awesome. Unfortunately, the guy they were trying to rescue. Uh, you know, didn't survive, but it was still pretty neat. I thought it was pretty awesome anyway. 
All right, so we're going to get into our Huey, and then I'm going to get my radio on. And then uh, we're going to take a look at the controls real quick. So, yeah, now the Huey, it, you can actually have four live people with you. Uh, pilot, co-pilot, gunners, gunners. So, you know, players can play gunners, which is cool. Uh, but, you know, obviously, I'm going to be a pilot seat. All right. Why is it dark? Is it nighttime? Oh, God. I hope it's not actually nighttime. Oh, no, it's sunrise again. Okay. Cool. But it is freaking dark. All right, let's get in the controls here. See what we see. All right. So we want to figure out our... Well, first off, we want to figure out our weapons. Uh, I've got the controls pretty much mapped comes down to like weapons and firing the weapons is really what it comes down to so AI gun panel uh, let's see burst switch uh, AI operator burst switch Rio show hide Rio okay okay left shift three pretty much all the AI is left shift two three and four so yeah nothing really difficult about that so that's easy enough all right so our ai will do its thing with just three and four left shift left control okay i can just liberate them to do whatever the hell they want to do which is cool damn this thing is tight yeah you know, let me back this off my face a bit christ it's like crushing my skull Ugh. I think my son was using my VR. Ooh. Squash. There we go. Let's see now. Um, pilot sight. Right. Armed and docked. Okay. Elevate, de-elevate, and pilot sight switch. Well, that's pretty easy. So, like, armed, docked, and switch. I know exactly where to put that. Pilot side up and down. There we go. Easy enough. Uh, let's see. Yeah, most of the flight controls are already put in here. I, I've done like the civilian stuff with the uh, Huey. I haven't really done any of the, you know, let me shoot this guy. I see. Pilot weapon release and machine gun. Oh, that's easy. Wow, do you think it's button two? Button two, button two, button two, button two. <clears throat> I think that needs to be cleared out. That hasn't been switched from default at all. Yeah, let's go ahead and clear that out. And then uh, we'll need to check our access controls. One of the things about default that I always found funny is it like defaults every control that you got, even if it doesn't have a button. Like, my router does not have buttons. <laughs> I always thought that was hilarious. It's like, uh, okay. There we go. Button four. I would like the trigger to be the trigger, please. Toggle tracking launched weapon. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Tracking launched weapon. Yep. Button there. Here we go. Uh, weapon released. Target released. Released weapon view. If we want to like check it out, like I do with some of the other stuff. Weapon to target. And then, of course, we want our F1 view. Go back to the cockpit. That way we can kind of see what's going on with that. I like watching the weapon slam into the target. I always think it's cool. Especially if I'm not sure what's going on there. It's a neat kind of just, you know... I mean, if you're going to play a game like this, have fun with it, right? All right, uh, trim. Helicopter trim is a little bit different. It's like... A, it's like a rudder trim, really. All right, pilot trim. I think I set that to up. Down. Oh, that's an MFD, you silly man. Oh, right. Clear that. Do, 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 do. Don't mind me. All right, so trim. Up. You up. You down. Left, right. Yeah, I'm going to have to set those. Okay. <clears throat> so view that up. 
Reset trim. We're going to press this button. Boom. There we go. Down on that because I don't need views. Since I'm using VR. So we'll do it that way. And then uh, we're going to do this. So <clears throat> since we know these things are set, we're going to do that. Clear it. There's the others. Okay. Clear it. Clear it. Clear it. All right. So now we want like lights. Oh, no, wait. I want goggles. 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 Hmm. Okay. No goggles. It's so probably night vision. Here we go. Night vision goggles. All right. Pretty simple. Uh, looks like I've already got this set to something. Uh, knowing me, I probably got to set here. Yep. There we go. Up, down. There we go. All right. <clears throat> Let's check our trim and rudders and things. Okay. Pedals. Stick. Collective should be here. Uh, collective. Question. Where is my collective? There's my collective. Light collective. Okay. Throttle needs to be. Because that is kind of a thing. Oop. Nope. Not that. Yep. Collective. There we go. Yep. All right. I'll probably just end up leaving that down. And then I already got my VR zoom set. Which is cool. Cool part about something like this is it is super easy to set up. That's what I like about it. It's like super, super easy to set up. Let's see. Arm safe down. Let's see. Say, uh, ugh, off safe. Armed down. Armed safe. Armed up. Armor selection up. Down. Gun selection down up weapon jettison I oh, know I've already got the gunner okay armament up and down now see I think I got this wrong I need to clear these clear clear I think I need select up and down so we're gonna go down yeah no 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 down make it like the tomcat down and then up right and then this should be my doors my gunner doors yep for my ai gunners there we go and then actually i should set my orders wait let's see where should i put that yeah uh should be able to do orders Hang on, I got an idea. AI gun panel. Mm, since my finger has the ability, let's do left, first switch. Yeah, uh, burst. AI operator liberate switch. Liberate? Elaborate, not liberate, dummy. <laughs> <laughs> Elaborate. No. <laughs> ah, yeah, okay. Me English. Well, me English. Good. So good. Yes. Well, okay. Let me get this set up here. Hold on. Uh, we'll put that here and go left. Yep. And then where's my right guy? There's my right guy. Right. And then Rio. There we go. Up. Yep. So that's that. Okay. That should work. I wish I could just set one button to make them all stop, but yeah, it's whatever. They'll only shoot at the bad guys. I mean, honestly. So, all right. That should do it, honestly. All right, stick looks good. 
Kind of slow, but that is because there's no power on right now. All right, so let's turn the night vision goggles on. What's up, dude? <laughs> He's like, God, we're going to die, aren't we? <laughs> yes. Yes, we are. You got to love it. Okay, so as usual, let's get our music on and get that started. So I don't know. Uh, this may go well. This may go horrible. Um, like I said, I've done the the commercial stuff because they actually have like commercial Hueys and things like that in DCS. Um, they have uh, quite a few neat missions, actually, for the Huey. And, uh, you know, from just like hauling cargo and things of that nature, which I think we could do that too. Um, let me check something here real quick. Okay. Yep. Nope. It's streaming properly. All right. Let's get the music on. I'm sorry. I was a little bit behind the life happened again. Life always happens. You ever notice that life just happens. It's like, everything's good. Then life happens. It's like, hmm, life. Yeah. It always has a interesting way of doing that. There we go. Okay. Mute that. Go. Let me make sure I got a good pick here. Let me make sure I'm getting. So the bottom of the screen should be there. Top should be there. Looks a little off. Looks a little off today. We're we about to have another Black Hawk Down situation, possibly. Shh. Don't jinx me. And yes, it is possible. I, I don't know. It, it could be. It could be. There, I want that there. All right, lock that puppy down. There we go. I mean, that's always possible. All right. Let's fire this bad boy up. That there, that there. Okay. Thankfully, the Huey doesn't take nearly as long to start up. Again, I haven't learned to actually start it. That's the cool part about most of these modules. They all have an auto start. In fact, the only one I haven't that I've seen that doesn't have an auto start is the Vigan. And it's actually pretty easy to start. Oh, right. I don't have my radio anymore. Shit. I forgot the SRS. Imagine that. And when it gets on, I wouldn't even know it. Nope, 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 yes. Okay, game. Good to go. Okay, let's rest. Now, this one's a little bit different as far as flight goes. This one, I think it's rotate the pedals to the right. I think. I don't know. Uh, we'll have to see. Oh, God. Hey, look, we're shaking. Yay. We're right dancing. We'll be fine. It'll be fine, right? It'll be good. It'll be good. I have absolutely no confidence in my skill whatsoever. <laughs> we probably should put some armament on this thing, yeah? Okay, I'm thinking... Many guns. That'd be good. Uh, rockets. Let's see. High explosive. Because that'll be his job. And then mini guns for us. And we're already overweight. Never mind. Oof. Mini guns weigh a lot. All right, let's go with 60 mils. Yeah, 60 mils.
Mm. Oof. Okay, I guess we'll go with seven rockets. High explosive sevens. There we go. Now it's underweight. Wow. Requesting the army. Well, I didn't hear a copy. I don't know if they're going to do it. Guess we'll find out. <clears throat> May have to take it to a runway. No response. Okay. Nope. We'll have to take it to a runway. Oh, the fun. All right. Here we go. Is it left or right? Uh, left or right? Left or right? I don't know. Guess we'll find out. Here we go. Adding collective. Which way are we going to bend? We're going to bend that way. Okay. That's fine. Holy shit. Oh, that wasn't so bad. Actually, I thought it'd be worse. Eh, it's kind of like the Apache, actually, just slower. That is actually smoother than the Apache. I'm actually quite shocked. We're flying, baby! <laughs> Hey, that's possible too. Yeah, we could go in no armament. Because that's a thing, right? No Dory Hunters? There you go. Because that would work well. Right? Good ideas. He's probably like, this guy's fucking nuts. <laughs> Why did I get stuck with this whack job? Because... Yeah, this is like old school. No heads up display, no nothing. You're just like, out here winging it. Like nuts, man. You like get so spoiled, you know? I mean, look at that. We'll be fine. It's gonna be okay, George. I promise. It'll be alright. Welcome to the express elevator to hell! Alright, uh, airport bearing is that way. And before you ask, no, the gauges are really that blurry when you have night vision on. They're terrible. It's kind of to simulate what night vision does. Night vision, you can see, but unfortunately, reading objects, not so much. It, uh, it blurs them out, except for heads-up displays, but that's like F-16, F-18, uh, F-14, you know, even if it's, I think it's first or second generation night vision, you know, but, uh, yeah, you have to, like, turn it off to see which way you're going. We're heading south, and we're gonna have to use a lot of F-10 map to see what's going on here, which I don't even see where the, there I am. I'm going to need to head southwest. Going at a whole 110. Actually, that's not bad. 105. 250 feet off the ground. It's shaking like a leaf. Need a probably need to back off the collective just a bit. 
Or not, because I think those were trees. Holy shit. I just barely saw those. Hello. Oh, don't mind me. I'm just having a panic attack. Fucking BR. You know that? Oh shit, look, when you you look up and you realize the car in front of you has stopped, that's the feeling you get. In VR, it's like, oh, oh god. <laughs> you know? So, yeah. <laughs> that is the feeling you get. Oh, good god. Okay. And just about got this trimmed up. There. And she wants to circle. That's better. Go more north. Got my directions backwards. All right. Towards the jungle in a helicopter. <laughs> yeah, watch out for that tree. George, George, George of the jungle. You ain't wrong, Rev. You ain't wrong. You know, doing stuff like this, though, makes me feel good, considering it's a study simulation and not just arcade. You know, it's like... Well, it was... What was it? Me and Rev came across that video where they were training Ukrainian pilots to fly A-10Cs. thought that was pretty badass, actually. Using DCS Worlds. Because of the simple fact that it's a study-level sim. The clickable cockpits will lay out the <clears throat> everything about the plane is modeled accurately down to the bolt. And that's freaking amazing. That these guys can actually learn to fly our uh, our planes that we're giving them or our equipment that we're giving them to defend themselves. You know. It, it's just freaking awesome. And it kind of tells you something, that anybody can learn to fly anything, uh, even in a video game. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hi, Amaki, how you doing? Yep, that was Amaki. <laughs> Thank you for the 50 videos, buddy. I need a clean pair of shorts. Uh, what's going on, man? All right, looking for our boys. I don't see anybody. Not yet, anyway. We're still pretty far away from the front line, but we got a lot of black smoke out there. Uh, well, we took off without dying. Um, got my north and south mixed up. Other than that, I'm okay. Doing pretty good. A little behind the ball on getting started tonight because uh, angry doggy bellies. But other than that, we're, we're good. We're good. We're good. Um, I was kind of hoping I'd get some uh, messages for Overlord Bot, but we haven't gotten anything back yet. So we're still waiting on that. I think I got my collective up too high. I need to bring it down. We're shaking a lot. Okay. All right. There we go.
Now this is in Huey, not in Apache. There we go. Let's get this trimmed out a little bit better. There we go. But yeah, no, man, I'm doing fine. It's a good day. I think. Why do I have a master caution still? Uh, okay. It'll it'll be fine. Is there a way I could just like smack it? <laughs> I don't know why we have a master caution. I'm not sure why we have a master caution. Everything looks good. Not overstressing anything. Everything's in the green. It's weird. That'll stop it. Oh, I'm sure it would. Hmm. Not sure what's happening there. Oh, well. I guess it's just flake of the day, you know? I don't see any circuit breakers flipped. We look fine. I haven't been shot yet. Traveling smooth at 90. Yeah. A lot of my guys are getting shot out of the air, though. Well, actually, they're doing the killing. Never mind. Yeah, we've been pushing red back today, actually, pretty well. I think they're back past Sierra again. So the war is going. But now uh, we were talking about DCS and, uh, how they were we found a video um in ukraine there or in poland yeah poland they are using dcs to train uh pilots for the ukrainian air force uh using dcs worlds and the a10c and they're taking the a10c's and taking them back to ukraine and using them after uh do a barrel roll like the other night, it'll be fine. Oh yeah, there you go. Do a barrel roll at a Huey. That sounds like a really terrible idea. <laughs> it's really not designed for that. Uh, but we thought it was really cool that they, you know, the game is that much of a study sim that they could do that and then fly it, fly the plane. They were talking about that. And it was like super amazing. So if you learn to fly a Legacy Hornet in the sim, you can fly it in real life. Uh, A10C, you can fly it in real life. The Harrier, any of the planes they have, you know, that are full simulation cockpits, or the helicopters. If you learn to fly them in DCS, you can fly them in real life. So we thought that was pretty awesome. It was actually kind of amazing. I think that might be one of our guys. Perhaps. Are you stable? You're stable. Okay. Let me get hooked on my uh, map here. Hold on. Hook myself and then zoom in. Uh, no, that's infantry, but I got two here by the city. Or maybe. We'll see.
<laughs> Flare and smoke support if I need. Thank you, boys. Basically, drop smoke and flares if I need support. All right, here we go. All right, let's try not to land on the guy. That would that would be uh, that would be bad. Up, up's good. Up's good. Up's good. Okay. Well. Hmm. <laughs> Can we request pickup? <laughs> Huh. Huh. I think I need to work on my landing a bit. <laughs> Perfect rescue. Yep, we knew this was going to go well. Let's try that again, shall we? Ah. Oh, well. And now I'll have two guys to pick up there. <laughs> That's funny. And this is what happens when you're learning a learning a mod, honestly. It's like, well, that went wrong. All right, door gunners. You know what? I'm going to leave the rockets off. And I'm just going to give mini guns. Yeah. Yo. Uh, do we have... Medical. Civilian? No. What about army medical? Do we have army medical? We do not. Oh, we don't have a lot. Civilian medical, UN, red flag, navy, BOS, army, 1972. Okay, let's try this again. Request rearming. There we go. Yep, Rev, you were right. Ooh, I like that one. That one's got teeth. Oh, no, 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 I eat you. Dude, I got a hell of a bro stash going there. I must know how to fry. I have mustache. Right? Mustache man. Derpy shark do 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 do. Yep, right. All right, try this again. Not bad for my first flight. And how long has it been since I've used this plane? Long time. Long time, actually. It's been a very long time. All right, burst short, short, short. Gotcha. I go ahead and open the doors for the gunners. Let them be able to do their thing. This could get interesting. I won't be able to do anything to any armor, but you know, hey. Danger, keep away. Should that say danger can't fly? Hmm. Just saying. Just being honest. I'm just being honest. Can't fly well. There we go. That's what it should be. Uh, still in bed. Ew. Oh, man. I'm sorry you're still in bed. Yeah, I figured you going to work was going to overdo it, dude. That sucks. Sorry to hear that, Ref. Okay. Not so sparing on the collective. This doesn't have the pickup the Apache does. So it is a... Right? Brick, flying brick.
You know, tell them free fire, shit's on like Donkey Kong. I mean, they can do their thing if they see something. So you got stuck in traffic? Yeah. Yeah. That's possible. You know, this is going to sound very, very droll, or very much kind of, yeah, Vietnam, that sort of thing, but I really feel like I should have Unfortunate Sun Cloud. It seems like a, re a prerequisite for flying the, Apat or the Huey. You know, like every movie, it seems like they're flying a Huey in a worse situation, that's what you hear. It's Unfortunate Sun. There's a reason for that, I think. I think I'd agree with that, yeah. Okay, he controls the guns, not me. Got it. Jesus! I guess he sees something. You must die! Burr, burr, burr. Burr. <laughs> Get him! Get him! Oh, he got him. Where he's getting him. Oh, he got him. Jesus Christ. Uh, so did you, did you get him? Do you feel better, George? Or bored on the bayou, right? Exactly. Bored on the bayou. Burner, burner, burner. It's still a Crete song. That was awesome. Just burr, burr, burr. Well, okay. I think you got him there, bud. That was rather cool. I mean, that won't do us any good against armor, but... You know, troops. Unarmored vehicles, that'd be rather cool. Ammo 85% Jade for Christmas. Plenty of bullets to go around, apparently. I think that Master Caution Light just stuck on at this point.
guess he must be around here somewhere. He hears me. Oh, there he is. One of our F-18 pilots is over here. Now let's see if we can actually land without breaking the chopper. Hey, I'm in a hover. Oh, I'm coming down too hard. Shit, 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 shit. Damn it, she started stalling. Ah. It's like, I'm good, I'm good. Shoot. Okay, let's try it again. I'm gonna kill more people. I will get this. I will do this. We will pull this off. I'm 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 never giving up on this. We will get this done. We will we will do this. I have faith. I will somehow get this going. Actually, I'm giving everybody many guns. Screw it. Everybody get something good. Go. Copy. <laughs> and a quarter. <laughs> right. And boom. I was fine too. I was at zero. Everything looked good. And then she, I, I don't know. I actually increased the collective and she went drop. So. It's something. I don't know what it is, though. Mm. I wish I knew what it was. I really do. Because I was good. I had enough rudder applied. And she was holding okay. And then I just lost it. So I don't know what went wrong. I'll just have to feel it out. I mean, it's the only way you're actually going to learn is just keep doing it. You know, it better than the last time. So third time's charm. At least it's entertainment value. So what happened? Well, he crashed and then he crashed again. And then he crashed a third time and then a fourth time. Okay. Could be. And see, that's the thing. I don't know enough about helicopters. Vortex state caused by descending too quickly with no airspeed. <laughs> Hashtag we believe. All right. So more collective, less, dr less descent rate. Okay. I'll try it. I'll try it. I will give it a go. Estrogen, right? Is that how you pronounce it? I don't know. I'm autistic, so I'm going to butcher your name. How are we doing tonight? And thank you for the advice. I will give it a try. Absolutely. All right. Open my door guns. Gonna put these guys on free fire. Boom, boom, boom. Go. Him on free fire also. Let's do it again. I believe I can do it. I learned the Apache. I can do this. And honestly, this is how I learned the Apache was trial, error, and keep keep going, you know? And then the things I couldn't figure out, I went to the book. And then I tried again, and I tried again. I just kept feeling it out, you know? All right, we're up, and we're going to go here. Let's 
so I want to keep it between 0 and 0 0.5. Got it. I'll let it become quicker than 0.5. Okay. Okay. We'll give that a go. All right, let's head back out to the southwest to see if we can find that pilot. Keep an eye on this guy right there. So that little mark right there, 0.5, we don't want it to go below that. It gets to anything below that 0.5 mark. Thank you for the tips. Backseat gaming is always allowed. Any tips that I could take, I run with them. Because I enjoy this game a lot, but, you know, being autistic, it makes it sometimes extremely difficult to learn things. I mean, you read it, uh, in my situation, I read it and my brain goes, Ugh! and then I do it, Sometimes it's a little bit better. I hear it, it's even better. Uh, so I will do my best to try to comprehend what you're saying, but I think I got it. Basically keep it between 0 and 0.5. Probably closer to 0, like I probably want it no more than 3 notches below 0 when I'm descending at low airspeed, like 20 or below. And I'll probably come in for a much better landing, so keep adjusting my collective to keep it around that mark and try to keep her steady and in is basically what we want to look for Let's see now if I remember right go around this mountain and then we want to adjust to 2-3 and we should find our guy Unless the explosion killed him, which I hope it didn't. I think we just killed ourselves. Dark on this side. Oof. All right, down we go. Okay, let's see if we can find this guy again. He was right around here somewhere. Too bad we still don't see our flaming wreckage. <laughs> Be like, oh, hey, there it is. You know. Oh, there we go. Bring her around. A little fast. The copter does not like the speed. He's up. There we go.
I don't see any baddies, which is good. Keep our eyeballs open. No players, no NPCs. Pretty much, I think we're too far behind the front line for anybody to really care. Obviously, he sees something. <laughs> Did you get it yet? Jesus Christ. Should I get closer? No, I guess not. Get him? All right. Nice shooting, Tex. Tom's been there. Our collective. Orc mode for bed. Hey, what are you What's going on, dude? Are you ever going to jump back in this, Gwitty? God. Okay. Why are we... Okay. Why are we doing this? Okay. Alright, you. What are you doing? Why are you doing this? Uh, she doesn't want to go up the hill. Alright. Or collective. No. Keep that rated to send above 500. Keep that rated to send above 500. Come on. There you go. Yep, yep, yep. Uh-huh. Hey, you just want to argue. She wants to fight. She definitely wants to fight. There we go. I'm trying not to, that's for sure. Alright, that's where we crashed. E okay. Oh, yep, they look, there's two guys there. I imagine that. I wonder why. <laughs> uh -huh. A little more forward stick. A little more rudder. Uh no 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 Okay. <clears throat> right. This is not easy. Holy shit. Steady. Damn, she wants to wobble everywhere.
All right, we look good. Now we can just keep her here. Hey, we're drifting down. Take it forever, though. guys hang on oh shit that's not where I want to be okay oh but I got some forward momentum okay I got this I got this come on baby be nice be nice be nice oh don't shake like that please don't shake like that no 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 quit drifting we're drifting. There you go. Nope, 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 nope. We're not coming down that hard again. A little more left rudder. Yep. Okay. We're drifting left. Come on. Right, she does not want to behave, does she? What about that way? Active like a motherfucker. Left rudder. Forward. Holy shit! Okay, no, not like that. <laughs> Whee! I'm on the fucking teeter totter of doom! <laughs> Alright! Mm -hmm. This is awesome! I'm gonna die! Up, 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 up. <clears throat> up. There you go. Mm -hmm. Oh god. Okay. We got this. We got this. Uh huh. Uh-huh! I gotta pee! <laughs> oh my god. What have I done? Nope, 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 Oh, not this crazy ride! <laughs> right? Oh, shit. He's coming, though. Oh, both coming. Yes! <laughs> okay, oh, wow! <laughs> oh, God. Are they both in? They're both in. Okay. They're invisible, but they're both in. All right. Right? Okay, let's get out of here. Here we go. On an incline. It's not a go. Alright, up we go. I don't care how much collective I'm giving it, we're just going. We're out of here. I never want to do that again. <laughs> Actually, I do want to do it again. All right, we're in northeast. Not that fast. We don't want to rip the rotor off. It's 
That was... That was intense. It wasn't exactly a level... landing place, though, you know what I mean? Alright, so we take him back to Dublin. Which should be right over here. Oh my god, you want to talk about a stroke? Hey, I need a shower, then bed. I uh, gotta be an adult tomorrow. I understand, Gwydion. I think if you stopped by and saying hi and seeing the funny. <laughs> oh my god, that was great. This is like, okay, okay, I got it. Okay, no problem. Landing on the park should not be nearly as hard. Shouldn't be. And see, that's kind of the thing. I want to be able to do everything in this server. I want to be able to do the ground support stuff, rescue stuff, you know. to air stuff I can already do. I didn't say I could do it well, but I could do it. Which makes me super happy, you know. I think that's it over there. I need to look at the map, actually. Let's take a look. Alright, I'm there. There's infantry there. Uh, it is. is that it? Fart. That's where I want to go, actually. All right, ruler says... Six. Need to turn seven, five for seven miles. All right, seven, five for seven miles. Gotcha. Oops, that's this way. like that notch line right there there it is there it is okay We just gotta get them on the ground. We gotta pick up. This is a lot flatter. We should be okay here. Not nervous. I'm good. We can do this. No problem. <laughs> oh god. <clears throat> yep. Yep. 
Yep. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, we're going way too fast. Okay, ooh, we're see. This is not an Apache, we can't do 130. I don't think we can do 130 without ripping the helicopter apart. Could be wrong, but it could pretty damn hard. Somebody in F-16 just said, hello! Is it me, or is it somebody else? There's somebody. That's Grimmy. Well, there's Grimmy in an F-18. He's out here. I don't think that was Grimmy, though. It was an F-16. I think. That might have been Grim. <laughs> Maybe it was an F-18. I'm not sure. Oh, I know it's boom. I oh, know it was Grimmy. Grimmy. What's up, Chief? Just like the last time, so this should be it's power lines. We're gonna turn around. That's power. I'm not playing with power lines. No, sir. Not mm -mm, no. That's Grimmy and F-18 showing off. <laughs> Show off. There we go. Oh, this could be ugly. Maybe. Uh, sure. Beep, beep, beep. You spin me right around, baby, right around. Okay. Where'd we go? Easy chuckles. Nope. Uh, let's go back up. Up is good. Yeah. Okay. Up is better than whatever the fuck you're doing right now. Why are we spinning? More left rotor. There we go. Less left rotor. Okay, okay. Yeah, like that. That 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 works. That works. That works. That works. So we just need to get in the box. In the box. In the box. That's good enough. Oh God. <laughs> Why has it been taken to the medical clinic? Good job. Holy crap! Oh. <laughs> Give me a thousand acres. I'll put the helicopter down, right? Uh. Okay, well, we did it. Two pilots. Predictions. I got people home! Woo! I did it! 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 I actually did it. Holy crap. It was ugly. It was gross, but... Yeah! I did it. Hell yeah. Oh, okay. Back up we go. Uh, actually, what do we look like? Let's check our fuel state. Uh, gas. Uh, gas, gas, gas. Hey! That's, that's pretty, pretty good. good! Right? 
I'm pretty happy with that. Quantity. Actually, we still got a lot of gas. Alright. Let's have to this bad boy and we're gonna go back out. I ain't just giving up on that. Alright. Looks like we got a whole lot of people still out here. Got another one on the mountain out here. Uh, we got one back here. Oh Lord, we got people behind enemy lines. We got people way all over the place. Look at this. All over the damn map. We're just... Look at all these guys. They're all over the damn place. Oof. Okay. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna be a busy boy. Right? Alright, nearest guy is there. We're gonna go into Oscar, though, see what's up. I mean, some of these are just infantry guys. I'm pretty sure. All of these can't be pilots. I wouldn't think. Could they? Oh, no. Okay. The pilots are these guys. Gotcha. There's an F-15 pilot. All right. So I see an F-15 pilot. Uh, yeah. So we got an F-15 pilot down. Where'd he go? He was over here. I this lost him. Where was he? Is he by this infantry guy? He was somewhere around here. Oh, there he is. All right, there's my F-15 dude. Right there, heading 21 for s no, heading 60 for about 21 miles. Okay, hold on a second. I gotta check on the dog. The dog's had really angry belly syndrome lately. And, uh, yeah, give me just a moment. I'll be right back. Just don't want to mess with me. I'll be back. I'll be very back. So yeah, we're going to go after this guy here. So we're going to travel 60 for 21 miles. Graham looks like he's doing our air support, or at least checking out the area. That's cool. All right, up we go. Oh, that's right. He doesn't have a space. Up, up, up. Gonna go straight six for 21 miles. Here we go again. Absolutely. I greatly appreciate an escort. I'm rescuing our pilots, so definitely. 
It's actually kind of a neat, uh, neat dealio with the, uh, Huey. You basically go rescue pilots, get more resources for your side. Yep, that'd be awesome. Grimmy's been up there in an F-18 kind of whirling around, keeping things off my back. In fact, he just clobbered, it looks like, a uh, SU-27. So, got a lot of down pilots on this side of the line for some reason. Do they have a minstrel? They should. I think so. Mystery. Excuse me. Hmm. Engine icing. Uh oh. That's why we got the caution. Uh, where's the icer in this thing? Uh, engine de icer. Eee, shit. I didn't think about that. Monkey monkey. Great. My engine's icing over. That's why I got the master caution. Probably why... Yep, Gazelle. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they do. Okay. Uh, force trim on... De-icer, de-icer. Over here looking for the de-icer. Hi, hey, buddy. Looking for the de-icer. Do you know where the de-icer's at? Wait, I thought I saw it. There it is. Okay. Uh, what's that? That's the de-icer, okay. You already ate goofball. There we go. The ice are on. I should kill the master caution. It's not though. But I don't have anything else on the warning panel. Okay, I ain't gonna worry about it right now. Let it do its job. See, that's the thing when you're still learning a module, it's like, okay, I got a red light. What's that mean? Where is it at? What's it do? Oh, God. You know, we're all going to die. Ah, uh, Grimmy got shot down. Son of a bitch. I gotta go rescue Grimmy. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, that's alright. We got the gas. This thing will run for frickin' ever, I swear.
Whoa! That was interesting. Makes me nervous there's an SU-27 that's close, though. We'll go around. Gonna stay close to the hills as much as possible. Jumped in a hurry to. No gazelles? Well, if there's not any gazelles, then uh, yeah. No gazelles? I don't even know if my radio's on. Have to check. I'm on 107. What am I doing freaking on 107? Gosh darn it. 107 and 116. Should be on 300 for the guard channel. Hell. Oh. I want to change that. Well, not why I'm doing that anyway. It's at 300 a.m. faster than it should be. Okay. She just don't want to take that trim, does she? There we go. I think she could freak that for shit. Really? Oh, that's the wrong radio panel. Duh. Three hundred. On. Anybody on this radio? Come back. Hello. Guess not. Let's see. Uh, nope. Damn. Okay. Blocking 131. It's weird. Why is it acting so weird here? 
I think my SRS radio is out to lunch. Uh, yeah, it's out to lunch. Great. Well, that just sucks. I'll have to figure out why it's not uh, behaving in the Huey. Three oh five. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I'm trying. Hang on, I got a lot of terrain in my way. That way the hell off course, too. 305. Okay. According to the panel, though, it's not switching when I switch. Actually, that's the UHF radio. Son of a bitch. Um, that's an AFCOM. Thirty and changing anything there, probably not. Yeah. Nope. Nope. <laughs> How do you use a radio with this damn thing? Mayday, mayday, idiot at the controls! Save me, save me! Uh, what's that do? <laughs> okay, you fly. I'll, I'll mess with the radio. Um, that goes there. This goes here. Somebody put something there. Um... Hmm. Okay. How about this one? Did I do anything yet? Uh, nope. Still at zero. Hmm. Wonderful. Uh, hmm. Uh, let's see. Intercom. Intercom. What if I... Two. Okay. I did jack shit for me. If I turn those somewhere. What if I do that? Nope, I think I shut them all off. It's not much. Okay. Yep, this working out well. Doing good. Yep. Doing awesome. That's not helpful. Eh, God damn it. Um. Oh. No. Okay. Two, three. I was doing jack squat for me. Everything's still zero. Six. Yeah, it's like incompatible with SRS radio for some reason. Now, SRS radio is not, uh,. All frequencies on SRS are zero. SRS is just flat line dead. Are you behaving yourself, SRS? Or are you just like up much? Oh, all my SRS freaks are zero.
Yep, all my SRS freaks is zero. I know, mine aren't the um, work It's probably a setting. I, I bet it's a setting. Yeah, the radio's on. Holy shit! Well! Okay! Ha! Oops. Mm. Knew that was coming, right, kids? Alright, hang on. Check my answer, my settings. The bar admin on, but I don't know. You know what happens? It's just kind of like, well, mm -hmm. damn mountain jump right in front of me. Well, I knew something was going to happen the minute I was messing with it, but. Now see all the radio frequencies just popped up now that I'm on here. It's like not a problem. But when I jump to the Huey, it looks like this one. Hmm. Guess they may not be set. I don't know. Oh, let's jump back in. We'll see what happens. I'm gonna keep an eye on that F SRS intercom. If they're not set, that's something I'll have to correct to the mission. There we go. And breathe. And fly. I mean, they just may not be set here. Yeah, they're all set in zeros. Guess we'll find out. Let's get a loadout. Oh, really? That's overloaded? Okay, M60s, guys. There you go. Mm, while he's doing his thing, I'm going to look this radio over real quick. Okay. IFF switch, right? Intercom, radios, radio, radio. Now, interesting.
There we go. FM 30, getting somewhere. Okay. UHF 251. Okay. Now the AM radio. It's UHF comms. Navcom. Where's the other radio? I need my AM radio. AM UHF. Is it up here maybe? I wouldn't think so. Hmm. I'm gonna turn the de-icer on before I forget about that. Uh, I turned something on there. That's the ADF. Okay. Apparently, I don't have an AM radio, but I have the UHF radio. All right, cool. Remy's on 305. Okay, let's make sure your knob is good. Volume is up. Oh God. Really, helicopter? Just take off without me pressing anything? Okay. Guess he's ready to go. Hello, hi, I'm in the air. Hopefully you can hear me. Transmitting on 305 UFA, UHF, AM. Car 54, where are you? Hmm. I saw you light up, but I didn't hear you for some reason. That's probably my, uh, it's probably my radio. Let me see if I can sort it out. It's probably still off. Oh god damn it. Okay. First we trim this thing out. Eee Alrighty, here we go. Don't kill too many squirrels. I won't. I promise. Kinda of surprised the startup sequence doesn't turn the radio on. It's good to know it does work though. Okay, it's the volume. Come back. Tom check. Tom check, anybody? I'm transmitting on 3.05 a.m. Gotcha. Five by five. Okay, okay what's the hell, man? 
Yeah, figures. No line of sight. Got it. I figured as much. I saw you flying after I crashed it in the mountain. Alright, on my way to pick up pilot that I left behind when I hit the hill. <laughs> nice. That uh, grimy mint silent might have nodded off. I am three miles off, off your left. left. Roger that. Gonna be going over the hill then heading 060. Yeah, it wouldn't surprise me if Grimmy nodded off. He was pretty tired today. You know, and that's cool if he did. I mean, everybody, it, it's a random Tuesday, you know? What's, What's your altitude? Just a hair over 1,000. Forty-one off the deck. Okay, okay so you're at treetop. I am at treetop. Hello. Hello. There's a Grimmy. I see you. Pull up, Grimmy. I am. I am just talking to you. Roger that. Grimmy's pulling up hard. I would say Grimmy's still awake. Look at him go! Shroom! Grimmy's mic may be muted, that might be the problem. Oh, yeah, I'm looking. Not seeing anything. Just basically checking map and following Valley at this point. True enough. All right, turning due north. Gotta go up above. Gonna make my altitude 3,000.
Okay, let's make that 4,000. A lot of mountains around here. Also, so don't forget I have an RWR or something. Oh, that's true, you do, don't you? I've got two shafts. Not, not sure how far away, but are too far, maybe. How's the sky looking up there, Grimmy? Still getting no response from Grimmy. I think he doesn't have his channel select to push to talk. Uh, I might be just uh, asking. Could be. Range is stupid limited. So you're getting, getting ahead of me a little bit there. there. You're not you're terribly fast. fast. You're flying a lot better than I did. Roger that, Grim. Did you check fire? fire? No, no stop flying. Oh. I feel you. I still got this master caution light that I don't know why it is just screaming at me. That's probably true. Mm -hmm. That wouldn't surprise me at all. Watch for the tree, guys. <laughs> hey, this is a master caution. Please don't hit the fucking tree. Okay. Yeah, I need to slow it down or she's gonna rattle herself apart. It's not made to do these speeds. Is this a Jeff Stone CS or now we're at 11 o'clock? Roger that. I see him. Uh. Can't identify him from here. Alright, uh, the phone's quite a ways away. away. Now I'm catching up to you. Roger that. I see it. I just let him out! She's barking because she can't get on the bed! Right?
Where's your objective? Wherever there's infantry or pilots that need to be picked up. Where that is, though. Yeah, wherever they are. It's basically fly around and look for them. There's not really a waypoint for it. It's just wherever people have gotten shot down. So what I have to do is get close to the ground to where I can see them and skim. There's a lot of them, though. And then take them back to the park. Exactly. Can in the sky, no kidding. All right, Digital, I'm gonna let you go out in front of me and I'm gonna keep scouring. As soon as we get over this hill, we'll go right. Or left, sorry, we'll go left. Or no, wait, I see somebody right on top of the hill. Starting now. Where'd you go? Went left. Look left. Heading is, uh... I went that way. Heading is 120. Yep, 120. I see someone. And of course, they gotta be on top of a mountain. Actually, it looks like a couple, someone. Climbing up. I really hope they're not in the damn trees. Abby, quit barking. So we're barking, disturbing my wife for some reason being a bark belly.
Alright, getting ready to make pickup. Hopefully I don't toss it. Yeah, true. Actually, four more people. Yeah, I did. Yeah. I know he's around here though. Got a radio message, so I know he's here somewhere. Oh, there he is. Okay, doop, 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 doop. Well, I'm not dead, but I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, I'm afraid you were going to tip over on the hill. Yeah, I slid. I almost had it. Is that my rotor blade flying through the air? It is. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Look, George, rotor blade. That's pretty badass. It's still flying. <laughs> well, okie dokie. That was funny. You up? <laughs> no, I'm down. I'm upside down. No, Doc Rockets win, excuse me. I knew that. I'd say this is a perfect landing here, Tex. But the bad part is the guy who I went to pick up still was confident enough to get in the back seat. Even upside down, that's great. Wait, wait. here we go. Yeah. Oh well. All right, grab another chopper. Excellent, man, but you have to get some sleep. Absolutely understandable. Have a good one, man. Take it easy. Get some shut eyes so you can keep on rocking. Take care of yourself. All right, you guys, Raiders, welcome in. Uh, my name is Commander Bishop, BDDCS. 
and a bunch of other flight sim games. I am a variety creator, though lately I've been really hooked on BCX. It has been a super fun game, and we've been doing a dynamic campaign. Uh, that is a lot of fun. Obviously, you guys came in as I landed upside down. We call it a controlled crash. And, uh, you know, kind of a launch pad and a quack sort of deal. Uh, this kind of all went wrong when I was trying to rescue some pilots, but we were playing dynamic conflict. And, uh, yeah. Oops. And I can't find the right buttons today. Hi, right, I'm a professional. Catch you, All right. Let's try this again. So far, record. Uh, three crashes. We rescued two guys. Right, George? So we're doing okay. Sort of. Considering my experience in the Huey is... <clears throat> I'd say I'm doing okay. Not bad. All right, let's get some armaments on this. Considering we forgot to do that the last time, so we're going to try that yet again. All right. So here we go. Uh, but yeah, you know, DCS, a lot of fun. I'm sure you guys play DCS. Uh, but uh, yeah, man. I'm having a ball with it. I've played DCS on and off for several years with Flaming Cliffs, and then I started getting into the actual more advanced modules and uh, got hooked on the Apache, the F-14. Then I got into the F-16, the F-18, the Huey. Um, I also have the Hind and a bunch of others. And I'm just going to go through each one, playing them, and getting my community uh, that I've been doing this for a few years now more into DCS as we've been going on, showing it off and having a good time. We've got a lot of great guys here. Um, Digital's been teaching us a lot as far as like F-18 and whatnot. And um, yeah, we're just generally having fun. So right now I'm doing rescue missions, which is probably one of the more boring things to do in the campaign, but it's still a lot of fun. So warning, a lot of flying, a lot of picking up guys, a lot of me crashing in very odd positions. Um, does equal a lot of laughs though, so it, it could get funny. So welcome in. Hopefully you have a good time. Uh, what time is it? Yeah, we'll be doing this for another forty minutes, and then I'll have to cut out, unfortunately, because my kids go back to school tomorrow, and uh, I have to adult. Yeah, we all have to adult. Adulting. Hmm. So adulting can be fun. All right. So wait for them to get loaded up here. Might as well set this guy to free fire. Arming complete. Go. All right, let's go ahead and get a radio set up again. I really only need to worry about this radio here. Probably gonna be masked by the mountain, but that's okay. Make sure the de-icer kicks on. Actually, I'll go ahead and kick all the radios on. Unless he won't. Really need it for SRS. Go. We're looking pretty good. That's okay. All right. And he'll take care of the rest. Boys are grabbing the M60s. My co-pilot's got the gun. Here we go. Now that's just a rifle copter, right? Exactly. It's weird. I set the radio and I went back to 251. Hmm. 
Hey, what are you doing just all of a sudden? Oh, I have to set up the manual, that's why. Right, coming back. I'll be able to hear me, but... Let's go collect myself. <laughs> all we have to do is look for digital. It's gonna be hard. Heading was 11. Don't ask me. I can always find my way in the sky and in space. It has something to do with the autism. Can't ever find my way in the ground unless I'm actually in a car on a It's weird. It works though. Uh, so we were at. Yeah, heading 11. Out there beyond that. It's pretty. Say it's probably about seven miles. Hello, hello. Airborne. Okay. Yep, I'm back up. The rescue went really bad. I crashed. Imagine that. One five. Yeah. 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 Barely hear you. Distance and this big damn hill. Let me gain altitude. That's weird. I can hear him just fine. fine. Yeah, I'm starting to pick you up better now that I'm climbing. It does that. What's up, man? Going somewhere else now? Uh, heading where I crashed. Uh, I'm where you crashed. Yep. That would be yeah, around that way. So Yeah, we're gonna get over the fact that this thing is such a rattle, rattle crap. And yep, I'm on 305. Copy that. That's what that does. Okay, I don't want to do that.
There's Grim out there dropping everybody again. Oh yeah, I see you up there. Been watching you. I can't spot you. In the trees. I'm on your left aft. It's a no seven o'clock. No eight o'clock. I'd say eight o'clock. Eight o'clock low. I guess I'm altitude to make it easier. Get out of the damn trees. Now I'm at your six. Three thousand feet. Moving to you. At your nine. At your twelve. Twelve high. Thank you. I'm sorry, I'm stupid. Six high. Go back to where I thought you uh, now. That's fine. All on you. Keep on going, I'm close. Oh god. Yes, 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 Which cheek was it? Yeah, good question. They all kind of look the same. Somewhere around here. Should have put that down on Right? That was on this side of that river. Well, generally, they were dependent for their house, but there's a couple peaks over there that I might Hmm. Maybe I can use my, uh, but the camera, camera thing spotted. spotted.
Yep, you go that way, I'm gonna go this way. Come on, you're three. We'll kind of spread out, take a look around. That's the other song they always play whenever you're flying in the bed or er, flying a Kiwi. Say what now? Is there a rescue? Uh, looking. Actually, there's one just south of me. I'm turning south to see if that's it. Going south? Going south. Do south. I don't think it's the same one, but there's somebody there. It's fine, though. Looks like they're in the valley. Oh, goody. How am I supposed to land in that? Right. Looking for a clearing. I'm not seeing one. Where's he at? In the woods. Uh, mountain face. I'm about to go over him. No, like, what are you using on the radio? radio? Menu. What do you mean? Uh... I don't know. I see him. How do you see him? He's a little dud on the ground. And he radios me and says, Damn your world. Pop smoke if you need me to. Flare, stuff like that. I haven't punched smoke. Oh, this is a little infantry guy. Okay. Yes, sir. Was there a small clerk down there? I don't see one. There is, I don't see it. Well, if you get some right under the tree, is he able to get in? No. No way. Mm. There we go. Trying to think of an idea.
can't tell if it's any infantry or tree trunks down there. There's two of them down there. Oh, never mind. No, that's you. I wonder if I can use my crane. Yeah, but I have dots on it, so I can see dots. So, yeah, I see them. How close are they to where I'm at? Uh, not far. I'd say less than 100 feet to your, well, what is it? 100 feet from you? Maybe two? 100 feet what's your earth? Trying to figure that out. Say 200 feet, 3 o'clock. Say again? 200 feet, about your 3 o'clock. Okay, copy that. that. I have dots. My eyes are bad anyway in VR, so I just turn dots on. Shit. Oh, God. Oh, trees. Oh, fuck. What's the, uh, button? What, for dots? For, no, no, for pushing that up, yeah. Say that one more time. What's the button for switching that stuff? Uh, it's labels. I forgot. I know. I don't know. Uh, hang on. Let me just throw this thing up. All right, I'm ready. Don't crash. I'm not trying. Failing. I should probably figure out what button that is. Spin me right around, baby, right around. Left shift F10. Left. <laughs> there we go. Yep, left shift F10. Should I turn it on for you? It's doing nothing. Oh, goody. That might be different in the Gazelle. It's different with every aircraft for some reason. Okay, well, let's get this under control before I eat the two. Oh my god. Don't oh, shut up. Come on, come on. You're going up and you're gonna like it. Okay, got control. Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't know why it's not here. Yeah, you might need to run the repair tool like I did. Remember, my canopy wouldn't close yesterday and because key commands weren't working.
I don't think I'm gonna get these guys. Let's just move on to a new one. Sorry, dude. Gonna have to leave you there. Get somebody out in the clearing instead of in the trees, because there's no way I can do this. Hang on a minute. Yeah, I'm hanging. Actually, I need to figure out an auto hover. Here, you take the controls. Don't kill us. I said don't kill us. What part of we don't want to die do you not get? I mean, seriously. Okay, yeah, fly in a circle. Thank you. Now, if that was only true, right? Autopilot, auto altitude hold. Love it. Auto orbit. Okay. Uh, well, do I already have them assigned? That's cool. I might kind of need it right now. Mm. Okay. That should work. It is so good. I don't see it. It's just right there. I don't know. Yeah, he's right there. I see him. Well, the dot for him. The answer is yes, but I'm dead. Ah. So much for the auto hover. <laughs> ah. Well, that's it for me. I have to adult tomorrow. Sorry, I gotta cut it an hour early, guys. But, um, hopefully you had fun. I like the, I like the, uh, there's so many different things that they got going on. It's, it, it's, it is a lot of fun. This campaign gets better and better. So, uh, hang on, let me get it into something so it's not screaming over this wall. There we go. Yep. But, uh, gotta cut tonight's stream early now. Tomorrow, what we're going to do is I'm going to reload the server into a training map. So anybody that wants to actually join us to do some training, uh, learn some flight modules like Huey, Apache, F-18, whatever. I kind of want to get everybody together to actually do that. Squirrel Blender, absolutely. Um, but I want to get everybody together and uh, learn more about DCS, whether you're flying FC-3 planes or where you want to get into a more advanced module or like me, want to learn more about the things you own like this or any of the other modules. Um, absolutely. But I'm going to keep flying around and playing, but I definitely got to get done streaming because I've got things I got to do, dogs to check on since they're sick today. Uh, so I definitely have to cut it early. But guys, thank you for hanging out. It's been a lot of fun. And uh, really appreciate everybody coming in. If you guys want to be part of the server and part of the community, you know, definitely smash the follow button and say, hey, how's it going? Get the server information, jump on. Uh, we're in and out all day. And uh, again, Doc Rockets Holly, or <clears throat> Doc Rockets Woody, thank you for dropping that raid in, man. Freaking awesome. And Ghost Freak 46 Gaming, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it, man. Seriously. 
it means a lot. Anyways, guys, have a great night. Be safe, and uh, I will catch you on the flip side. All right, bye-bye.